What's up everybody, my name is Vince. Welcome to the channel. I know why you clicked. It's because you've been waiting for some news from the Milwaukee Tool Company on their new offerings for 2020. Year in, year out, Milwaukee has their NPS event, their new product symposium, where they announce their newest tool offerings. This year, that wasn't possible. So the event was indefinitely postponed. But, <laughs> for some of you, it's like shock and awe. You're seeing some stuff happening, but you just can't, you're not focusing, you're not realizing what's happening. You're seeing something, but you just can't identify what it is. We're gonna show you what's up and what's going on and what you <laughs> haven't realized is going on right before your eyes, right after this message from our sponsor, VCG Construction. If you've been here for a while and you're not new to the channel, you'll know that right here, we did a video, go check it out, where we asked you, how would you like the new product offerings from Milwaukee to be served up to you this year? Do you want them delivered, you know, snail mail from the US Postal Service? Did you wanna get them through influencers like us? Did you want them to come over in an email? Direct to your mailbox? Did you wanna see it on Instagram? Did you wanna see it on YouTube? Did you wanna see it on TikTok? We, have realized that Milwaukee has made a decision. They didn't come out and tell everybody exactly how they're gonna do it, just like Milwaukee normally does. They just run with things. They're running with some new offerings, and this is the thing. These are offerings, and especially one of them, is an offering a lot of you have been asking me about for years, and I have been telling you for those years, after speaking with Milwaukee about them, are you gonna be releasing this? And their response to me was, it wasn't their focus. Their focus was to create more battery operated tools. When I saw this tool come over, I said, aha, this is an offering that was going, because this is huge. This was going to be announced at MPS, but they've decided because it's indefinitely postponed, they're now serving it up and they're doing it quietly. They're not saying, hey, this is an MPS offering. They're just, releasing these unbelievable offerings. First on the list, it's the Packout Cooler. Now, here's the deal. This is not the Packout Cooler. This is the Packout Toolbox, half-size toolbox. It's pretty cool, comes with some organization. You put those dividers in, you're able to organize your tools. They've decided to make the Packout Cooler based on this box that was gonna be announced at MPS. But because it's been postponed, you're seeing it here first. Most likely you didn't realize you were seeing an MPS item. And I'll tell you something else. As these new items that were supposed to be NPS releases, as they're released, we're going to release them to you, give you the specs, the numbers, the pictures, as much in-depth information as if we were in Milwaukee at the live event. You're gonna get it here. We've been doing this for years and the show will go on. Nothing will stand in our way. We're gonna bring it, we know you want it. We're gonna give you NPS for 2020 right here. The only way you could see it though, and not miss anything is to get subscribed and tap the bell. Here's what we know about the cooler box. Perfect for on and off the job site. The new cooler is equipped with a 16 quart capacity, an integrated bottle opener, pretty cool, and interior storage tray. It's IP65 rated. The Packout 16 quart compact cooler withstands even the harshest job site environments. So they have a whole bunch of SKUs, of boxes, large boxes, compact boxes, co customizable foam, but the new one is brand new. It's product number 48-22-8460. The cooler is the Packout 16 quart compact cooler. I know a lot of you are excited to see the pictures and know that it's going to be available. It's it's hard side and you could stack other boxes on top of it, making it more versatile. I'm excited to see it. I gotta tell you, the cooler bag, eh, I was never too blown away. Here is the big one you've all been sticking around for. It's product number 2840-20. That's it. 
It is, and this one's crazy. I know you're excited to see the pictures. I was shocked when I saw it come over and that's what immediately made me put two and two together. These are offerings that would have been released at NPS. I think the goal is to dribble them out a little bit at a time because everybody knows, here's the deal. NPS usually happens. What happens is Instagram and YouTube and TikTok usually turns red for like a day or two. I think that they're going to dribble out this information, these huge releases in onesies and twosies fashions in order to keep Milwaukee Tool in the news cycle on YouTube, Instagram, and TikTok, okay? They're, they're trying to stay in front of your face by dribbling these out. These are huge releases. Harnessing the power, performance, and runtime delivered by the M18 fuel technology, Milwaukee Tool has developed the industry's quietest cordless air compressor for professional carpenters and remodelers. At only 68 decibels, the M18 fuel two gallon, two gallon, that's for a battery operated compressor, is huge. Two gallon, compact, and it's quiet. Compressor is also two times quieter than standard corded compressors, reducing overall noise on job sites. The only thing you're not, the only noise you're not going to be able to Lower on the job sites, my big voice. At only 68 decibels, the new compressor drastically reduces one of the biggest frustrations with compressor usage, the noise. At less than 31.2 pounds and equipped with two carrying handles, it's easy to transport to and from the job site. A low profile and stackable design aids in storage as well. I will tell you this much. I like, it's got that roll cage you'll see in these pictures. It's got that roll cage kind of construction. Here's my thing though. This is the reason we're probably going to need to see this sooner than later. You know, and I like this style of compressor. I really do. Usually this style of compressor I would use would be corded. I think I like the versatility of being able to just pop in a battery, go to work, tote this thing around the job site, and not have to worry about plugging in. Here's the deal. Their decibel rating, 68 decibels, I want to confirm that because everybody knows what the decibel rating is for hearing protection and such and the people around you and the things that people are gonna be dis disturbed with. Sometimes Milwaukee can deliver tools that they're really great and they deliver really great performance, but sometimes they overblow and they hype it up so much and the thing is, is that if you didn't overblow and overhype it, people would have been super excited. And, you know, I'm just going to say from 2019, one of the greatest tools that came out of the 2019 MPS that didn't need to be overhyped at all because it's a great tool. It's one of my personal favorites was the M12 Surge. The decibel rating wasn't as low as they said it was. It was low. It was low, but it might not have been through the testing as low as they wanted you to believe it was. I want to I wanna believe that Milwaukee has, they got a little pushback last year from that. I want to believe that they learned their lesson and that this compressor will clock in at that 68 decibels, but we're going to need to test that out. Not only for my own curiosity, but I know you want to know. It says here, through M18 red lithium battery technology, the tool eliminates the hassle of cords and delivers the power to fire up to 1600 18 gauge brad nails per charge on an M18 red lithium high output XC 12.0 battery. For ease of use, the compressor has a quick change coupler connector and a single turn regulator equipped with front facing gauges and battery access in close proximity. Users can easily adjust the compressor when needed. It's unbelievable. This is the thing. People have been asking for this one for so long and, and what we had gotten, the answers that we gotten was, we're moving towards battery operated tools, not pneumatic. And when I saw this, I was surprised. I did not see this on the horizon. Let me know down in the comment section if you saw it on the horizon. I didn't think they were gonna do this. I thought that they were just gonna move forward with battery operated nailers, staplers, brad nailers. I, I didn't think that they were gonna give you a pneumatic option. If you like having options, smash the like button. 
Also, make sure you're leaving it down below. What tools do you want to see released in 2020 from Milwaukee's NPS? These are the first to be dribbled out. I'm thinking that every day for the next, I don't know, maybe every day or a couple times a week for the next few weeks, they're going to be dribbling these out. What do you think is next? Leave it down below. Everybody, I appreciate every single one of you for being here. We'll see you on the next one. Video's over, but I know you want more. So this is how you're going to get it. First thing you need to do is pretend you're this guy. And you're here at the birthplace of freedom. Now ring that bell like it's 1776 and let all notifications through. What? You're not subscribed yet. Well, smash this button here. After that, watch this video here, here, and maybe over here. See you later. <laughs>